Hi, my name is Danny, and welcome to Esoteric Moment. Today, I have something a little different. I'm gonna give you a tour of an Earthship. The last couple days, Brad and I have been staring at an Airbnb, and I thought you guys might enjoy a little bit of a tour. So I'm gonna turn the camera around and start walking around and explaining what you see. And if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. This is the front door of an earth ship. An earth ship is an earth bermed home. So you can see the earth on the north side and the south facing windows here. This allows the temperature of the building to stay regulated, usually about 70 degrees. The windows are at such an angle that the winter sun heats the home further and in the summer it is blocked out more. So the walls you see here and all the ones that are touching the earth in the back of the house are made from packed tires. So a way of recycling all of the garbage we have. And you can see the front here. There's just lots of windows that open and allow ventilation and the solar panels, which collect energy for the house. This house is entirely off the grid. This Earthship is a studio, so it's got a bath, a kitchen, and one kind of living bedroom space, which I'll show you when we go inside. It's also got a little fire pit here and a clothesline to dry clothes. This is the back door facing the east, so lots of ventilation, easy to get in and out of. This is the roof, which collects rainwater, which is how the house gets water for drinking and bathing. You can see the rocks in the vent there. So that vent allows hot air to escape when it's open. The rocks allow just basic physics to open and close the vent. You can see the tops of the cisterns that collect and hold the water. And over here is where the water comes from the roof. And then has a couple filters to make sure that big gunk doesn't go through and then is filtered further in the house. This is the front hallway slash greenhouse. Water is recycled through the planters from the sink and shower and gets pumped back to the toilet. The living space has cooling pipes buried in the earth and a normal, energy-efficient kitchen. The bathroom is huge and filled with natural lights. The water pump was noisy, but really that's our only complaint about staying here. We love staying in the Earthship. Today I am doing a book review on the Urban Druid Handbook. I'm gonna make this review very short because it's really warm outside today in Wisconsin and I would like to escape quickly back into my dark, cold abyss of apartment. 